Hi everybody and welcome to episode 67 of us playing Valheim. So in this video I promise that we, oops, I need to go get more food. In this video I promise that we will go and see if we can get some uh, silver up in our nearest snow biome. We see if we get lucky. I'm not going to take my cart with, even though I'm probably going to regret it just now. Because I don't need that fourth one. Uh, leave the sausages here. And we need to replenish some of our cooking. But we'll do that when we get back. So for the time being, we are now going to head to our nearest snow biome, which is up there. In the previous video, we went and got obsidian, and we got our first piece to the summon the dragon in the north boss in the snow area. So now I have to equip that instead of having my weight belt on, but it's just till we find it. I do have frost protection with me. And we do also need to do a copper run. And we've got plenty of copper in this forest. We actually haven't mined any copper since we moved here. Okay, let's put the speed run on. So I don't use so much stamina and we just run straight through. But I do need to go and do a berry run as well. Like I said, we're running low on all supplies. Because I've just been building. Oh, that's actually quite clever. I've never seen that before. Nice. And more feathers. I don't know what to use that amber for. I never know what the amber is used for. If someone feels like telling me, leave a comment there and tell me what the amber is used for. Because I always just leave it. I've never used it in my nearly 400 hours of playing this game. I've never actually used amber. Okay, we're almost there. It's a bit of a long run. Uh, for everybody that's just joining, I am doing, uh, it's, I wouldn't say it's hardcore mode, because everything is just set to hard, but it does disable portals. Uh, one of the recent patches that came out about a month ago allowed for this feature and i'm quite enjoying it because see so we're near something shiny here but nine times out of ten there's just bones when it comes to the meadows well that's a dragon village that was not expected and trust me there's a lot of them Because we've also got that Draga spawn right next to our base. Okay, now that we are here, let's activate this so that we do not freeze on the mountain. There are wolves that spawn up here, so we've got to be a little bit careful. There you go, I just heard some wolves now. I think, there you go, I heard them again, I just didn't see them. I want to see them before they see me. Uh, 
Oh, he sold me. Because they still hit very hard. Oh. I knew I should have made a quick little spawn point here. <laughs> oh well. I had a feeling I should have done it. But we'll be there quick quickly. Uh we've got more frost potion. Just take one. And we'll just stop by and grab food while we're here. I just knew I should have made a quick little spawn point. See, this isn't stamina food, it's uh, combat food that I just ate. So you notice my stamina bar didn't go up, but my health bar like drastically shot up. But being naked, I'll go. I'll run faster. Yeah, the wolves actually generally have like a a two shot attack, and like I said, an episode I think it was sixty two or sixty three. Oh, there's a one-star cave troll. Uh, like I said, episode 61 or 62. It's actually good to tame them. Like wolves, they are very strong. And if you can get a one-star one pet, oh, you're, you're strong, you're invincible almost. You just take your wolf with you. And he will run after everything, but he will also do a great job in protecting you. Don't know how good he is against trolls, but all these annoying graylings and skeletons that keep chasing me. I think he'll be perfect for that situation. So yeah, we're almost back. See, there we are. If memory serves, I built a little campfire here, but that's about as far as I got to building us a spawn point here. But when I saw how small this place was, I wasn't too concerned about it. Like it wasn't going to be a an adventure mountain, basically. Okay, we must remember there's a Draga village here, which we don't want to mess around with while naked. So I'm just going a little bit to the, the right. Yeah, we're pretty much here. There's the snow, there's my body. You can see it just on the top of my map. As so we end up coming close to the Draga spawn. Okay, let's head up the hill. Okay. To eat that recharge our stem. We're going to run up. Once I've managed to find us a silver node and I'm able to mine it, 
Okay, let's be careful of the wolf. Once I once I'm able to do that, uh, where's my body? Yeah, once once I get those, then I don't need to make uh, frost potions. I can just literally. Oh, rude. Then I just make myself a wolf cape. Wolf was over here. He's still here. Oh, there's two wolves. By this time we prepare for it. Where's his friend? Oh, what am I doing? There we go. That was a bit of luck there. He nearly got me. Okay, we still haven't picked up anything on our little scanner thing. Okay, let's be careful. There's another wolf spawn up here somewhere. See, told you. Oh, that was even a worse thing to do. Oh, I was hoping to get lower. Okay, guys, this mission on the mountain is not doing so good here. But it's fine. I will make a spawn point uh, on this next run through. So we don't do this again. It's a good four minute run. I'm busy watching the timer here. Uh, let's take a little bit of honey, just to go some stem. This one gives just a little bit more. Because right now we're, we're lacking in stamina. So yeah, when we get our body this time around, I oh, will definitely build us. It's just a quick little teepee. Uh, a little bed and a, like a little two, two by one little spawn point. If I'd done that the first time around, I would have saved us like an eight minute run. <laughs> So yeah, let's definitely do it this time around. It's pointless just running back and forth like this. Lots of deer. Didn't even realize we're on day 140 already. So 
sidestep that skeleton for a little bit. Another skeleton man in front of us. I did not bring the foss. Oh, I ate it already. Didn't mean to eat it, but... Oh well. There's more on my body, so... Let's go, let's go. Faster, faster. Okay, we're now here. And we just gotta fetch our body, get our tools, and then we'll make a quick little uh, makeshift spawn points. Like I literally died like right here. So that's the first one. Yep, there is my body there on the hill. We'll quickly craft ourselves a little spawn point here. Yeah, I've got enough space. Because I ain't running back. So we quickly just pulled this out. Doesn't need to be anything fancy. If you notice, I've even put the walls the wrong way around. Okay, oh, don't have enough wood for the bed. But let's hope I've got enough for the roof. Okay, now I've run out for the wood, for the roof. You'll notice I'm currently doing this naked because I can move around faster. So we can play enough of the bed now. But I don't have enough for the chest. And I want to put my frost potion inside the chest. Like that. Same like we did at the other run. Take one with me. Put that in there. Put that in there, that, that, and that. And I can put this on. Okay, that sorts our inventory out. Uh, it needs to be the wishbone. Can I sense hidden objects? Yes. Okay, let's go for our stem. Probably not the best way to get up the hill, but we're going up this way. Uh, okay, I kept my food on me, which I shouldn't have done. There's Mr. Wolfy Wolf. Okay, 
See, as long as I see them before they see me, I'm good. Okay, we still haven't got any notice of anything shiny here in this little biome. I didn't really think there would be any. Okay, here another wolf. If anything, this will just be like a little balding biome. Like there's not even obsidian up here. What is that? A bit of obsidian? Probably not. Nope, just a stone. Okay, let's just wait for our stem. Wolf is probably like just on the other side of this. Okay, still nothing good. Can't remember if we searched up there, we probably did. Okay, we did avoid the centerpiece on purpose. I thought there would be a wolf here. Because I can hear them, but I just can't see them. Yep, there he is. Oh, there's two. But at least our spawn point is right here now. Just trying to get low enough. Because now I don't need a frost potion if I die here. Oof. Nasty. Couldn't even get a head off. But we're right here, so that was kind of the point. I try to get as close as possible. But this mountain's kind of a dud. So let's just take all the stuff. Not in that slot. Just grab our body. And then we're just going to head back home. Bit of a bust of a mission. But now we at least know. Oh, that ball got me good. At least till I get my body back and then I hit him one shot. Uh, food, yeah. Oh. Okay, well, suddenly can I not carry everything? Okay, there's that. Don't need that. And we've got plenty of resin, so. And I don't want the body to stay here, so let's just dump it out. Boom. Okay. Let's head home. Sorry, guys. Wasn't the most interesting of videos right there. Someone's a little house. Yeah, let's head home and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. This was episode 66. We did learn one thing though from doing that. 
Even though that was a bit of a rubbish mountain, it was still good to know that there's no iron up there. Silver. Because then what we can do is... Oh, there's a two-star. Then we know we've got to make a, a trip for that island, that snow area again, where I kept dying. But we must take a forge, we must take... Uh, Everything we're going to need, including a lot more food. And then we hit that, hit that mountain properly. But yeah, I shall see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. This is Ages signing out.